Well, and, uh, thank you for agreeing to share some time on a Saturday with uh, all of us. My name is George Smitherman, and I stand before you as a man who has enjoyed much experience in public life, but I have been inspired to public life by the times of Pierre Elliott Trudeau. And the Charter of Rights and Freedom stands as a uh, bond with me, uh, with minority communities, because I'm a gay man. I come from a community that has uh, suffered from oppression, sometimes at the hands of government, sometimes at the hands of police and such, and I think it's essential understanding in terms of addressing diversity. I'm very, very interested to be a mayor that actually makes sure that we give real life and meaning to the motto that we as politicians rely upon too much, diversity our strength. For I think that there is actually lots of evidence that for all of the diversity that we have, we're squandering that strength. Some people have actually put a $2.2 billion cost on it, and I think that we need to step up to the plate and recognize that Toronto cannot fulfill its greatness. It's great in many ways, but it cannot fulfill its full potential, so long as too many people in Toronto remain on the outside looking in. I appreciate that we're in an evidence-based environment tonight, because one of the pieces of, that we have to confront in this election is that Mr. Ford, as a candidate, believes that Toronto is grown to the point where we have too many problems, where actually growth in the future should be limited, that we should depend upon only those that have arrived here, and those plane loads of individuals that arrived at Pearson today, and those that will come to, tomorrow, who have decided to invest their strength and their vigor and their skills and their experience and their birth rate in our city of Toronto, are not needed, are not welcome, and from an economic standpoint, are not necessary. I don't agree with that. Today I've launched a policy, I want to recommend it to everybody, I'll talk about it more tonight. It's jobs and opportunity for all. It's about Toronto living up to that motto, diversity, our strength. It's about making sure, as an example, that the City of Toronto leads by example and uses its $11 billion spending power, spending power in a way that actually gets the job done for diversity and respect.